Welcome back, and thank you for tuning in once again as we follow the misadventures of Sarasota Tim. I want to give a special shout out to all the Sarasota Tim Truther channels out there, including Blind Views, Darling, LOL Olive, Miss Vicky, Grifters Anonymous, Iggy, and Dr. Falcon. There are some really talented content creators out there. Please visit all their channels and give them a thumbs up. Also, I apologize if I have left out any content creators. I watch all your channels. As the winds of Hurricane Milton prepare to slam into Florida, the state braces for yet another round of disaster. Houses are being boarded up, supplies are running scarce, and neighbors are banding together to face the worst. But far from the storm's chaos, cruising comfortably in his tundra, we find Sarasota Tim, the Internet's least essential humanitarian. While the rest of Florida buckles down for impending doom, Tim has executed his genius emergency plan. He is driving far enough away to make completely useless YouTube content. Tim's got to keep that YouTube AdSense revenue rolling in. Tim's got his trusty RV, excuse me, mobile mansion, which he proudly reminds us is basically a house on wheels, letting him flee nature's wrath without disturbing so much as a decorative candle. Meanwhile, here I am in my mere mortal, sticks and bricks home, foolishly anchored to a single spot. How quaint. But wait. This time, Tim's pulling out all the stops. He's dragging along his two most gullible accomplices, Fred and Raffella. If you've missed a few episodes of the Sarasota Tim soap opera, Fred and Raffella are the latest elderly couple he's latched onto ever since he and Tammy's not-so-epic saga hit the skids. Now, Fred and Raffella are unknowingly playing their part in Tim's next master plan. You can practically see the rusty gears turning in Tim's half-functioning brain. Yes. They'll pay for the hotel, and the gas, probably even some meals. Perfect. And if I play my cards right, I'll be their caretaker, maybe even an heir. Genius. Oh, make no mistake. Tim's already five moves ahead on his imaginary chessboard, ready to checkmate poor Fred and Raffella into being his permanent meal tickets. But will they all cram into the flagstaff together? Or will he convince them to splurge on a hotel? Who knows? The suspense is killing us right? And naturally, in between talking about tires and saving his elderly sidekicks, Tim has to drop a plug for his Amazon affiliate link. Forget the hurricane. Clicking that link is the real cliffhanger here. Folks, don't leave Tim hanging. You wouldn't want him to have to air up his tires again just to keep us on the edge of our seats, would you? But honestly, the true highlight is knowing that somewhere between a light drizzle and a full-blown hurricane, Sarasota Tim is out there, towing his well-inflated RV, dreaming of a Rolls-Royce he will never own, and schooling his viewers on the fine art of mooching. For anyone traveling in the same area as Tim, be safe. Because when Tim hits the road, the world just feels a little more dangerous, doesn't it?